Thanks for tuning in. I'm Mike, and I'm here in the control room at LBA Studios today to demonstrate the new 2020S. This is an instrument transformer, much like its predecessor from last year, the 2020. The difference here is the new 2020S has a different core. You know, as I mentioned in those previous videos, I'm manufacturing these transformers in-house, so I can tweak the formula to get different results. And what I was looking for was a transformer with a little bit more sonic coloration, a little lower price tag, and something that can saturate at a lower volume. These are all things that the new 2020S has to offer, and in today's video, we're going to get into some of that stuff. I recorded myself playing a few different instruments, and then I mixed it, and I made two copies. The only thing different between these two copies is the version that says bypassed has not a single 2020S on it, where the version that says active down here has at least one 2020S on every single instrument. So any differences that we hear between these two versions of the same musical piece are specifically caused by the 2020S. Let's start with the bypassed one. I'll toggle over. All right, here's the active one again. Now I did level match these so they are the same volume. The difference here is the one that has a 2020S is clearly more compressed. And then uh, once more we'll go back to the 20S version. I'll go back to the version without one last time. Okay, so I think even with YouTube's encoding that kind of crapifies the audio, you should still be able to hear a difference, especially if you're listening with decent headphones or through some nice studio monitors. I'm going to also include the audio in a download link. You can find that in the description of this video. Mm -hmm. 